still in a lot of pain right now? Or? Yeah. His eye swollen shut as you see the top of his jaw split in two and his nose fractured. This teen's face tells the story. The worst part, he says he has no idea who did it to him. And that is where he needs your help because his biggest fear is that his attacker is going to get away. There is a search out there tonight. It's just ridiculous that a grown man would do that to a child. Make that more of a hunt. You have to reset his jaw. His upper jaw is broken. And it is not going to be pretty. His nose is broken. His eye socks. Eye socket is broken. To find the man who did this to a little boy. I have a broke my uh, eye, two bones of my eye, the top of my jaw, like the roof of my mouth. It's cracked in half, and I broke my nose. 13 year old Dylan Aquaro didn't think anything of the two men on racing bikes riding up Route 168 in Newcastle in Hickory Township, Lawrence County, until it hit him. There's absolutely no reason to do this to a child. None. The lead rider on this road punched Dylan in the face and knocked him out cold, putting a little boy in the hospital and breaking his mother's heart. You know, no adult deserves this, you know, let alone a child. Now Hickory Township Police are on the case. And again, these are bicyclists. These are not motorcyclists. I believe it was like a 10-speed. Uh, we're trying to obtain usable uh, footage of that to put out for the public's assistance in identifying these two people. And with surgery tomorrow to wire his jaw shut, Dylan's mom knows one thing for sure. You know, you don't punch a child in the face. This makes you so mad. Hickory Township police are looking for two bicyclists. They are both white men in their 30s with facial hair. One was wearing a yellow bike helmet and a yellow shirt, the other wearing a blue helmet and blue shirt. If you know anything about this, please pick up the phone. Call Hickory Township Police at the number there at the bottom of your screen. More 